Hello, Douglas County. Welcome to the 15th DCTV23 Weekly COVID Update Show. I'm Rick Martin, Director of Communications and Community Relations for Douglas County. And I'm Communications and Media Specialist Lena Hardy. Thank you for joining us. Cobb and Douglas Public Health issued a public health alert due to evidence of community spread in Cobb and Douglas County. Per guidelines from the health department, we continue to encourage citizens to wear a face covering while being in public, wash hands repeatedly throughout the day, and practice social distancing to fight the spread of COVID-19. To read the full alert, go to CelebrateDouglasCounty.com. Lena, according to the state of Georgia's latest situation report, as of July 16th, Douglas County has 1,545 confirmed cases of COVID-19. And sadly, 40 of our own citizens have passed away due to the virus. On behalf of the chairman and board of commissioners, we would like to send our sincere condolences to the families of those individuals affected. The state of Georgia created a COVID-19 hotline with the sole purpose to answer your questions and address your concerns related to the virus. If you have questions and wish to speak with someone, call the COVID-19 hotline at 844-422-2681. Please note, Cobb and Douglas Public Health has moved the testing site from Hunter Park in the city of Douglasville to the Douglas Public Health Center on Selman Drive. This drive-through site is free and open Monday through Saturday from 8.30 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. Also, as of July 16th, Cobb and Douglas Public Health has tested over 4,600 people. Remember, anyone can be tested regardless if they have symptoms or not. Visit cdphcovid19testing.org to complete the online testing referral to make an appointment. Individuals who arrive without a pre-approved number from Cobb and Douglas Public Health will not be tested. Cobb and Douglas Public Health would also like to remind everyone that they are now doing contact tracing. Therefore, if someone is contacted by Cobb and Douglas Public Health and notified as a contact to a case, they should go to the new testing site on Selman Drive to be tested. There's a chance if you go somewhere else, it may not be free. Douglas County Commission Chair, Dr. Ramona Jackson-Jones, has decided to launch a new educational campaign to mitigate the spread of COVID-19 by providing mask recommendations for Douglas County residents to wear a mask or face covering while in public. You should expect to see visuals from this campaign on billboards and signs around the county. A special public service announcement with members of our local governments will hit your television screens very soon. As a matter of fact, this Friday, expressing the mask recommendations. Also, Douglas County has received about 20,000 masks from the state for citizens to pick up. These masks are free and available at government facilities, such as the Douglas County Courthouse, libraries, and the Transportation Center. Only Douglas County citizens will be able to receive masks and will be required to prove their residence via driver's license or verbally. Douglas County citizens, please remain informed and follow our daily updates on CelebrateDouglasCounty.com, Douglas County Happenings Facebook page, our DCTV23 Facebook page. Thank you for watching. See you next week.